Hello, let's talk pronunciation, especially of final consonants. Okay, so a little review. Um, a lot of words in French end by E that is not pronounced. So why is it here? Let's look at some examples. That word will be pronounced RO. We don't pronounce that T. But that word will be pronounced ROL. Because we have a E, it makes us pronounce a L. But we don't pronounce that E. ROL, at least in standard French, I would say. And then there's a rule for uh, final consonants. It's a clarify meaning that if your word is ending by a C, a L, R, or F, you pronounce that consonant. Okay? Of course, there's an exception. If it's ER, most of the time it will be pronounced A. Like for infinitive verb, parler, manger, écouter, all these verbs, we pronounce it A, not Parler, manger, okay? So, uh, to look at some examples, I have some symbols that I'm using. One is a blue dash that I put under the vowel, the consonant, sorry. That means that we do pronounce it. It's voiced. And a red slash, meaning that it is silent. We don't pronounce that consonant. And the I'm using the half circle that is for a usually silent consonant that is voiced because it is followed by a vowel sound. That's what we call a liaison. Okay, let's look at some examples. I'm using sentences that we use uh, when we first introduce each other. Okay, the first word, bonjour. We are in the clarify role, so we do pronounce that R. Bonjour. Monsieur. Ha, huh, here's an exception. We don't say monsieur following the spelling, but monsieur, at least in 2021 and a few years before that. Mademoiselle, je m'appelle. We have that E that we don't pronounce, but that makes us pronounce a consonant. Mademoiselle, je m'appelle. Okay. Let's look at some formal sentence and informal ones. A. Let's start with A. That's a big one. ET will be always pronounced A. And there will never, ever, ever be a liaison with it. Okay? You can never do a liaison with that little word ET. A. Vous. That's a consonant that we don't pronounce. It's not in our clarifying rule. Okay? Comment? Same thing. Vous appelez-vous? Huh. We need to do the liaison because we have a vowel. Okay? So that S that wasn't pronounced now is pronounced as a liaison. Comment vous appelez-vous? And we don't pronounce that S. Et toi? Comment? Still not pronounced. T'appelles, we don't pronounce that S, okay? Comment tu t'appelles? Et toi, comment tu t'appelles? Okay, so that's the right way uh, to pronounce these words. One more sentence. Enchanté, comment allez-vous? Here we have a vowel, so that T that we didn't pronounce here is pronounced as a liaison. Comment allez-vous? We don't pronounce the S. Comment vas-tu? Je vais, not pronounce, très, not pronounce, bien, merci, et vous? Ça va, merci, et toi? Ok? And one last one, très bien, we don't pronounce that S, merci. Super! And we have to pronounce that R, that's another exception. Merci. Merci à vous. That's it for today. Keep practicing and talk to you soon.